Hello friends! Um, a comment asked me to review this brand of one of Holbein's lines. Um, this is the Vernet Superior Artist Oil Color. And this is one of the most expensive paints I've seen, but I don't think it's primarily because of quality. Holbein, um, I'm probably pronouncing that incorrect, but whatever. Holbein, Holbein, um, is a Japanese brand. And distribution outside of Japan from every Japanese country uh, is a bit of a shit show. I mean, even look at how much postage costs in the United States right now and how it's going up again every six months. Um, yeah, distribution outside of home countries is a bit of a shit show, part of my language. This is a sample pack. Each one of these is about 10 milliliters, which is extremely nothing. And it cost me on Blick about $20 before shipping. So yeah, we're gonna take a look at this little box. And these are some really weird colors. Pyrrole Red, Imadizolone Yellow, which I've never heard of before, and Thalocyanine Blue. These are not colors that I have in my collection to compare against. Um, I have never used Pyro Red. I, I don't even know what what is this. Image is alone yellow. I, I don't know. Um, yeah, but I have decided to lovingly call this space paint because look at this packaging. This looks like something out of a little bit retro futurism in my opinion. The larger bottles also look like this. This is just pure retro futurism in my opinion. Um, these are tiny, tiny bottles. Here's a 40 milliliter. Here's a 10 milliliter. It's, it's, yeah. And we're going to mix them with white, because I honestly have nothing to compare these things against. We got the weird yellow. Ooh, there's a card in here. The, I ha ah, look at that. It has a little, little thingy. It has this whole thing probably of all their colors in Japanese and in English. That's, that's, that's great. Yeah. We got this whole thing with explanations. What does it say over here? What is the finest oil color? Hoban search for the... Yeah, whatever. I don't care. I'm not reading that. I bonked my camera a little bit. Close. There we go. Oh, this, oh, there's the colors on the other side. In Japanese and in English. Yeah. They do have normal colors like alizarin crimson and... and Where is it? They're silent. Ultramarine, they have the, what's considered the standard colors. So I don't know why they chose this for their little sample pack. Like, they chose very strange colors. I don't know, man. I just I just look at things. There's nothing else in here, but there's a little little thing in the background that no one can look at. That That's good quality marketing there. Um, yes, I'm not sure if this is going to be good quality or bad quality, because I'm pretty sure the majority of the price is in the distribution. So we will find out. We are going to mix some thalocyanine blue with some titanium white number two. I don't think it matters if it's titanium white number one or two at this point. So we are, yeah, with the space paint. Oop, there we go. As far as sample packs go, you can just go to uh, Williamsburg on the Golden Colors website, and there's a drop-down menu. You can just request sample packs, but I think they give five milliliters. And you can't request, and you can record specific colors, but you can just pick random, and it'll give you just random colors, which I think is kind of nice. You just put in your address, and they give it to you. You know what? That is smooth. There is no extra oil. That that is smooth as heck. We're gonna. Oh, that is deep. That is really well pigmented. Oof. You know what? <laughs> I'm already kind of impressed. Um, yes, I know this is supposed to be their top tier brand, but I wasn't expecting much because I thought that the part that all the money was in distribution, but know, maybe I'm all wrong. Um, yeah, we are not going to compare this to anything because I don't have the specific colors to compare against because most of my, that is nice. What the hell? That is nice. That is a really nice shade of blue. What the heck? And that is really well pigmented. That is nice. Okay. Okay, I'm already impressed. I'm already a mite impressed. But this video has only gone on for four minutes now, so we are going to mix one of the other colors. But that is a nice shade of blue. What the heck? I might need to get more thalocyanine instead after this. Pyro!
if you want to take a look at the bottle a little bit, it's mostly in Japanese, not intended for use by children. But yeah, they have their little pigments on and everything. I just like this packaging. It is space paint. Ta-da. Oh, that is nice. That is a bright, bright red. The sun is getting in the way. Construction is going on. What? It is thick. It is well pigmented. There is, there's just, it, I like this paint. I, I okay, I have been converted. I have, <laughs> usually I head towards Michael Harding, if it's not apparent enough. Uh, Blue Ridge, I like. The construction is back outside. You're gonna hear banging. What is this? Maybe not enough white, but that is a night. Nice, what? I don't think we even, even need to look at the yell. This is okay. I am impressed by, by Bernat, but it's also very expensive. But that's construction noises. Uh, I don't know if you can hear that or not, but yes. Um, okay. I am officially impressed. Um, it's well pigmented. It's working well with, with, with Michael Harding. There's not any additional oil. The sample pack says 10 milliliters, but maybe a little more. I don't know. Um... They give, I have never tried Thalocyanine Blue before, and I'm impressed. Okay, I think I've just been converted to some new colors I don't ordinarily have in my palette. And this company that has very expensive paint, but I don't know, I have friends in Japan. Maybe they can get me some cheaper stuff. Yeah, in Japan, this is probably reasonably priced and doesn't cost $20 for, for a sample pack or $30 per color. So if you happen to be in Japan, or going on a trip, and you're an artist, maybe you should just go to an art supply store and pick some up. Um, and, and I might do that on a future vacation myself. I don't know, in like five, ten years. Um, yeah, you know what? This, this gets my vote of approval. I definitely like this stuff. We are not even looking at the yellow. We are just like, this is some good stuff. So yes, space paint. I approve. Uh, thank you for watching. Uh, thumbs up and like if you wanna. I don't really care. I'm not in this for the for the likes. Uh, so yes, thank you. Have a good day, everybody. I will not be here for a couple of weeks because I am in fact going on another trip. Thank you. Goodbye.